kind of go back over, amen, the churches that we're talking to about because we're over in Revelations, if you remember, if for those of you that are on the prayer line and on Facebook, uh, we're going to be over in Revelation chapter 2, verse 12. want to pick it up. We've been starting with chapter 1 and we moved over to uh, verse, I mean, chapter 2. It's kind of looking at verse 1 through 8 and then we continued on. And, and we've been talking about the letters that were written to the seven churches in Revelations. Now, we got to understand that there were seven churches and Sister Barbara and Tony, I mean, Tanya and Tony too, because Tony is online. They, they, they memorized all the churches. How many churches was it? It was, it was seven. First lady says seven. It's, it says, so when you look at Revelations, you're really starting to look at the, the, the letters that were written to the seven churches. Amen. And so, again, as we remember, we talked about the fact that, that the Apostle John uh, is on the island of Patmos and Jesus comes uh, with this revelation. So revelation means to, to reveal. Amen. Somebody write that down, to reveal. You, it's amazing how he was on the island of Pat Patmos and sometimes God has to get you alone so he can reveal what it is that he wants you to know. I, I wish I had somebody. You've ever been alone. You couldn't hear it when you were with people. Hey, Amen. It was too busy. It was too noisy. But sometimes God would take you through something that, that where you are alone and he will begin to speak to you and reveal some things in your life. I wish I had somebody that can praise him right there because I remember many a times, hey, amen, when I was hanging with the wrong people, I couldn't hear what God was saying. But God, in some kind of way, began to remove the, the wrong people out of my life and began to remove the, y'all ain't never been delivered from nothing. They began to remove the wrong things out of my life and he got me alone. And I, I received my calling on the in the back porch on the patio, amen. And I'll leave it there because it was more stressed than that. But he got me alone and he began to reveal the purpose that he had for my life. I wish somebody can just praise God with me right there because sometimes God will get you by yourself and begin to speak to you.